What's going on guys, gonna go over my trading setup, gonna shoot this one vlog style, but let's come take a look at what I currently have. So this is my trading setup, I'm gonna kinda go over what I have, what's going on. So the first we have the M1 Max, I have the uh, 24 core GPU, terabyte hard drive, 32 gigabytes of RAM, I'm gonna put everything in the description below, I'm gonna have a kit so you can basically go to Amazon and if you see anything that you want. You can buy it from Amazon um, through that, or you can just kind of see what I have in my setup. But uh, you can actually see right here on NQ, I have a uh, $600 winner. That's that hook, line, and sinker pattern that we talked about. We took that one today. So I do um, trade of eight. I have think or swim on here. And then this, this screen is connected to my M1 Mac and I have a market internals and kind of discord. So I have two screens going. And then my main screen up here, this is from my Mac mini. This is the M1, 16 gigabytes of RAM. Um, I got this originally. So before I had the M1 Max, I had the Intel Mac and the thing would overheat so bad. Um, I couldn't even plug in an external monitor because as soon as I plugged in an external monitor, it would overheat. Um, and I basically I'm up at 6 a.m. and the fans on that on the computer would be on before the bell and if you can hear no fans I've thrown everything at this Mac at the M1 Max um, the only time I hear the fans is if I'm like video editing like if I'm exporting video and think or swim is open then I hear I hear the fans but pretty much I can stream YouTube I can stream Spotify Trade of eight, think or swim. I can have a bunch of apps open and the fans don't turn on. So it's really good. So I just have this screen to look at charts. I have kind of on here to the left, I can see quick. I have the VIX, I have the sectors, so I can I have uh, all the futures and then like stocks that I'm, I'm trading or watching, kind of like the main, the main ones. And this is just so I can glance. So if I'm trading down here, I can just glance up and kind of see what's going on. And then I have different stocks like Tesla, Apple, Futures, and then I move these in and out. And then same with over here, I have like a YouTube stream and then um, I have just other stocks. So these two monitors are connected to the Mac Mini and they're purely just for visuals. It's kind of overkill, you don't need that uh, if you're trading, but I originally got it because the, the Intel Mac just wasn't cutting it. So I kind of have the workload split up between two computers so I can just have because if you have too many charts open, too many windows open on, on Thinkorswim, it, uh, it, can, it can slow it down. So I kind of have the workload split up between two computers and it makes things run smoother. I have a Yeti mic, uh, I'm going to upgrade that soon, and um, you know, Logitech keyboard, Rolex sub. Um, this is Aperture Light Dome for YouTube, and then I have some guitar stuff over here. Look at this beautiful guitar. Fun fact, made in Germany, Duesenberg. This is the most expensive thing in this room, and I have Apple laptops in here. So, I mean, I guess the Rolex is more expensive. Besides that, that's the most expensive thing. But, yeah, that's my trading setup right now. Just two monitors for, for visuals, and then I execute all of my trades on the M1 Max, and the M1 Max is so good, I recommend it. It's It literally is night and day difference between the Intel Mac. I mean, it's insane how good this computer is, and you can just throw everything at it, and it's still, um, and it just, defan it, it, it runs perfectly smooth. So I'm sitting here in a, in a trade on ES, because I took this hook, line, and sinker pattern on ES with NQ. Um, I took took off five points and now I have my runner. I got, if you can see it here, I got my runner stop plus, plus uh, one point. That's my trading setup. So I'll put everything in a link in the description below in the kit. Um, everything from uh, the stands to the ethernet cables. I'm running everything through a port right here. So I have my internet uh, internet plugged into that and then I'm, I'm running that into the Mac mini and then I have an adapter so I can I can hardwire in my Mac, I'm not on Wi-Fi when I'm trading, just it's, Wi-Fi is good, but if you're hardwired in, it's always going to be better. But anyway, uh, let me know what you think about the setup, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.